In today's video, I'll be showing you how to better your mic in OBS by letting you take your mic from this all the way to this by just using simple methods. So let's not waste any time and get in today's video. So with the first step, you want to go ahead and click on your taskbar and open up your OBS. Once you go ahead and open up your OBS, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and click on your mic just here with the three bars. You want to go ahead and click on your mic input. Then you want to head over to filters. Once you click on your filters, so for the first step, what you want to do is you want to click on this add button and you want to go ahead and add a compressor. So to make this simple as possible, I'll read out all the settings that I use to basically get the same results. So for your ratio, you want to go ahead and put that on 5.00 with two dots and the one. Then you want to head over to your threshold and you want to put this on negative 20. Then for your attack, you want to put this on 1 millisecond. Then for your release, you want to put this on 60 milliseconds. Then for your output gain, you want to put this on negative 1. And your side chain ducking source, you want to just put this on. on. Then once you're done with that, you want to go ahead and click on the plus button and you want to go ahead and add a limiter. Now once you add the limiter, you want to put your threshold on negative 5.10 and your release you want to put on 38 milliseconds. Then once you're done with that, you want to go ahead and add another plugin which will be the VS2X plugin. Now this is a plugin but it's free, I will leave a link in the description so you can go ahead and download this plugin. So to basically open it, you just want to find, all you need to do is install the plugin and you will find it here. Once you find it here, you just want to click on it. Then you want to click on open plugin interface. You want to go ahead and click on presets and you want to put it on brighter and basier. Now you can go all out your way and literally pause the video at this point and copy all the settings that you see here. So once you're done with that setting, now that setting will improve your mic a lot. You want to go ahead and click on the add button and now you want to go ahead and add a noise gate. Now noise gate is simply something that's going to help everyone which will block the noise around you. So go ahead and click on your noise gate and you want to put your close threshold, put that on negative 56. And your open threshold, you want to put that on 45. Now you can go ahead and tweak it around those two numbers because maybe your mic might be different to mine. So go ahead and just tweak that. Then heading over to attack time, put that on 20 milliseconds, your hold time. 200 milliseconds your release time 150 milliseconds then once you're done with that you want to go ahead and add a gain once you add the gain the gain is simply just going to gain your mic more louder in most cases save you will find your microphone a bit soft you want to go ahead and add some volume and some gain so for me i'm using 14.50 this might not be perfect for most people but you can go ahead and just you know tweak it lower and move it around and find what works for you but anyway those were the best settings and your microphone should be sounding just like this but anyway if you found this video helpful please give it a like or subscribe to the channel for more tips and things just like this anyway i'll see you in the next video peace out